Hi, Jim and I. We're doing a read on for um, general general read, Jim and I for October 2024. Jim and I, your air signs have been interesting tonight. Libra, the camera didn't want a video out for her Libra. So I don't know. Let's see what happens for you, Jim and I. All right. So. Oh, look at that. I'm writing it in the love spot. I just noticed that. Lord have mercy. I am so gone right now. We have the... You know what I just thought of? <laughs> you guys, I thought of the Wizard of Oz. So I don't know why. And it's not. This is the Strength card. But I just thought of the Wizard of Oz, Okay. And that is so, um, such a great picture we have at the bottom of the deck. Five of Swords. So right away, someone, this is a general message for you, Gemini. Someone don't like, um, your strength, how strong you are. And that's what I'm saying. I'm thinking of Tim Man or something like that. I don't know. So the Wizard of Oz, the Lion, and Tim Man, what? the heck is this but the wizard of oz is a classic it's a legend so this person thinks you're that okay they think you're um and it was made you know the original they're bringing me to the original one okay if they point out 50s 60s i don't know but it's made a long time ago i'm gonna look this up because i don't know why i got that right away for you gemini all right, so Wizard of Oz, okay. Something about your originality, your original, definitely with the strength card. You're very strong, okay. Confident, self allured you know what you want. Um, you go after what you want with that card. You also could be uh, dealing with the Leo. Someone could also have a little girl, okay. Or two little girls. They're also saying twins. I don't know. So um, maybe you might have a twin sister, or you guys, um, someone could have twins. So not everybody. A, a very short message for someone. Okay. But um, anyway, that movie is legendary, um, it's classic. It's got a very good, distinct story to it. So, yeah, someone tried to sabotage your you guys, okay? Whoever I'm talking to, someone don't like how strong you are, how confident you are, how, um, yeah, they feel like they can't break you down or tear you down, okay? With the Five of Swords, that's what they try to do. So I don't know if this person is still in your life. Their energy is around you though, okay? See that rainbow? That's what I'm saying. They don't like um, how happy you are. You could be happy or you could just have an um, easygoing personality. Your temperance could be very easygoing. You let stuff roll off of your back. You're not, you know... You don't worry about much of nothing. That's what I'm picking up, okay? This person tried to sabotage that, okay? They don't like your happiness, your easy, light, um, free spirit. They don't like that, okay? They don't like how um, you're not problematic or you're not stressful or you don't play into stress or chaos. Yeah, look at that. You block them. Seven of Wands. I split the deck. You got seven of Wands. Could, you guys could have a lot of people um, jealous of you or trying to sabotage something you're doing. Or it, it, I just pick up your happiness, okay? So your inner peace, your inner happiness. Um, people around you may not like that. Um, they could be jealous of that with the Five of Swords. I do see you blocked this person already. So there again, that's what I'm saying. You're not accepting that type of energy into your life. Now this person, it looks like they're still trying to like come in some type of way. You're blocking them. It's a no. They need to stop. That's what I'm seeing. 
Tell me more about this person. Oh, Ace of Cups. Wow. So this person is a lover. All right. They want an Ace of Cups with you, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Also, this is a strong Aquarius here with the Five of Swords. That could be um, that you're blocking. Can be, doesn't have to be. But it's air, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Strongest energy from this card is air. Then we got Ace of Cups, uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Hmm. Hmm. So let me see here. What else? Wow. Yeah, they want a, a full card. One hit and one shuffle. Full card came out. That is also Aquarius energy. So it's Uranus energy, okay? Ruler over Aquarius. Um, so yeah, with the full card, they could be an air sign wanting to take a chance with you. If not, for others of you guys, it is an Aquarius. Others, it could be a Leo. They want a chance with you. And um, they could feel like a fool. They could feel like a clown. <laughs> um, maybe they're going to do anything they can or something. Because it does look like they sabotage. Yeah, look at that. The bottom of the deck. They're too serious or something like that. King of Bats, which in this deck is the King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Yeah, two of Bats. Oh, it looks like um, they could took too long to make up their mind or make a decision about you. They could have did that and you could have left or you're not even looking towards them or something like that they, it looks like this person from your past sabotaged the situation here and now they're feeling like a fool they're feeling like they should have took a chance with you um they should have acted they should have did more yeah they also see you view you as very strong let's look here Gonna get some messages out of here. What does this person want to tell? The sign of Gemini. Okay, red dress. I want to sex you all night. You are sweet pleasure. What is it? You are sweet pleasure me says I want it rough from you it says I want to taste you all night I love your underwear it says touch well touch myself okay so he's letting you know what he's doing it says you are so beautiful okay these two want to be read together it says you are so special to me I want to marry you wow okay and the last one it says you are my fantasy that's what I'm seeing. Yeah. And it's like they're getting ready to come through and tell you something. At the bottom of this deck with the King of Bats, which is the King of Swords, they're ready to talk to you, communicate with you. They're getting ready to let you know something. They also, they're pointing out the nighttime. So in this deck, it is made mostly at night. The whole deck is night, isn't it? Yeah. So they are going to be contacting you guys probably in the nighttime here. Okay. There's the Ace of Cups again. You can't tell me. And it's sticking out so far. That's why I'm showing you guys. Ace of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And this deck is the Ace of Ghosts. So this person could have ghosted you. Could have left you in the past. Yeah, I feel like they're saying they sabotaged something here with the Five of Swords. They sabotaged something. They ruined something before it could even begin. Now they want this again here. We have the Ace of, Co of Ghosts. <laughs> I don't know. You like Coca-Cola or something. You like Coke. Someone could like uh, Coca-Cola. Okay, soda. The soda. Um, or maybe the other one. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, guys. All right. So, again, Ace of Cups. They're also manifesting you as Saw the Magician. Same stuff is showing up here, guys, in the deck here. Both Ace of Cups and both decks. They are ready to come through. They're ready to have take this risk now. Before they sabotaged it, it looks like they were also straddled. They didn't know what they wanted to do with the Two of Bats behind the King of Swords. So Two of Swords behind the King of Swords. They didn't know what to do. Um, they could have been in a limbo about you. They could have been straddling. Um, they could have took a long time to make a decision here. And that's why you left, okay? So now they're ready to take a chance with you. They might, I feel like they want to do whatever in this card. 
I feel like they might look goofy or silly in front of you. Something like you never seen this side of them before. Um, that's what I'm getting, okay? Um, they're ready to talk. They're ready to communicate. They're really ready to, to um, talk to you, okay? So that is all I have for you guys, Gemini. Until next time, take care.